at a restaurant, so I feel extremely lucky. Long Oven in Scott's Edition, one of the first Richmond restaurants to close last March. I maybe thought we were going to be closed for two months. I mean, we really just didn't know anything. Co-owner Patrick Phelan says they scaled back and spent the past year constantly reinventing the business. I think COVID will be hopefully like a, a root canal. You know, you, you remember it being painful, but it's hard to go back and really remember it happening. It's, it's, uh, it's been very different per industry, but fundamentally it's about being able to adapt and change. Professor Robert Cowley with VCU School of Business says COVID restrictions laid bare a key business theory. There's a Darwinian theory of economic survival and, and Darwin always said it's not the uh, strongest who survive, it's not the smartest, it's the most uh, adaptive to change. The million dollar question according to Kelly is what changes consumers will expect moving forward. He says like after the Great Recession, it could lead to unseen innovation. It seems like when we go through this period of pain and we go down into the valley, um, that's when us as a nation, as a society, our creative juices start flowing. When you're running a business, uh, you're kind of like riding on a bike and you rarely get the chance to step off and tinker with it, you know? <laughs> and uh, COVID basically blew the bike into pieces. At Long Oven, Phelan sees changes in technology and how they connect with new customers as a silver lining that doesn't diminish the challenge of the last year. A real opportunity to stop um, and consider how we wanted this bike to go down the street. You can read more about this and other Rebound Richmond stories on WTVR.com.